Hey there, Internet. So we're on our way to Park City. Today we're actually checking out Slam Dance Festival, which happens the same time of year as Sundance on the same street as Sundance. A lot of people don't know about this film festival, but it's really cool. It's more of like the independent film festival, I feel now. What Sundance um, used to be. What Sundance used to be, really. Unless you have a major celebrity in your film, most likely you're not going to get into Sundance. But with Slam Dance, you actually have a fair shot to get in. And to give you an idea of some of the folks who have come out of Slam Dance, Lena Dunham, her first movie didn't get accepted into Sundance. It got accepted to Slam Dance. And because of that, she was able to get her footing with HBO and get a, a TV show. And in another nice note, they gave us a press badge. I which, remember that. Which is a really nice thing. So thank you, Slam Dance folks, for hooking this up. All right, so we just got our tickets for the Slam Dance screenings. I want to mention the Directors Guild of America is the sponsor this year. Definitely check them out. So here we are at the Filmmaker Lounge. Yeah. Chit chat with some filmmakers before seeing some movies. I'm here with Oslo, who is also your special. I'm a programmer for the festival, and also um, I run the. I'm the theater manager. Uh, I'll do some Q and A's with the filmmaker and some and something even special. You're the first person I saw at the festival. Really? He was like, hey. The most special thing. So I'm here at the Black Magic. Um, demo area at Slam Dance. Can you tell me a little bit about this? Yeah, absolutely. This is our Black Magic Design um, DaVinci Resolve mini panel. Uh, essentially, it's an uh, affordable panel for freelance colorists and anyone who uh, essentially wants to color grade DaVinci Resolve with a uh, physical control surface for this panel that we've made. Um, we have the advanced panel, which is uh, $30,000. Much, yeah, no, much bigger, yeah. It's much bigger, and uh, a lot of the top colorists in the world use it every day, but what the mini panel does is it gets you about 80-85% of the same functionality of the advanced panel, ah. a much smaller real estate with a much totally. uh, lower price tag. So while the advanced panel is $30,000, this one is 90% more affordable at $3,000. Making art is kind of like training a pet in some ways, and that it's like having this like need to do something and it's like always there and you just, you have to get it out and... Uh... This was two minutes on the screen, so um, how many hours did it take to, to assemble? <laughs> Probably like over 300. 300, uh, I'm sorry, break that down in like months or weeks. It was a year and a half, um, but also that was because I had never done it before. It took a lot of time of like just screwing it completely up on everything, so. <laughs> Would you do it again? Oh, absolutely. All right. <laughs> Everyone please, a round of applause for Gabrielle Pack. Check out their film, Falling. It's a narrative short. And check this out. They even had, I've lost the hand warmer already. You lost the hand warmer? Hold on, This is the best filmmaker swag I've got. You got the swag, baby. Well, we're also doing a story about you know, struggle, and so that involves conflict and pain and suffering as well. So I think that. Our aim wasn't, wasn't we weren't trying to, we weren't actually even thinking that far ahead in terms of are we making a happy movie, are we making a sad movie, we just want to tell the story of what is the struggle for free freedom and human rights across the world. And sometimes it's fun, sometimes not so fun. Here with the selector of Freedom for the World, a documentary about how democracy has gone to shit. Probably the best documentary at Slam Dance, and you can find it at or Sundance for that matter. It's coming soon. It's coming soon no, on no, our Facebook page. Your Facebook, Twitter, and Twitter. It's Freedom for the Wolf. Check them out. Go ahead. Uh, last call. Hombres y mujeres. So it's sadly last call at the Slam Dance party. Okay, guys, we're going to pick it up. Eduardo, and you've got a film in the show. What's it called? No, actually, I am in the Venice TV. I'm doing all the editing on all the films here. Good to meet you.